All right, and uh, I've just uh, crossed the state line into Idaho, and uh, now I am crossing the state line out of Idaho. Yeah, it's amazing how thin this section of Idaho is. Um, it's literally just uh, about a second and a half, maybe two seconds by car. So, and the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs> they have one uh, for sale. Two to fifteen. Kind of in the middle, the front so, uh, what's your secret? For what? Yeah, I think it's, that's well, the, you know. And the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs> We've been standing here for one and a half hours, waiting for the master to take his throw. So the winner is Jim. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> How does it feel? How does it feel? God. I gotta call my mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm waiting a lifetime. Well, you gotta say what the score is. You're not saying the score. Okay, so he got 61. Right. And second place is Chris. All right, wait, are you sure about that? Double check the arithmetic on that. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So, Chris got 90, I mean 67. <laughs> 67 second place. Third place got Mark with 68. Ooh, that was close. Ooh. It was that last hole. Right on your heels, yeah. That my opening drive was what saved me. Yeah, yeah. Keep reading. Um, okay. In fourth place is my dad. What just Felix? With 94. Um, this is in, making for great film. In fifth place, got my mom, Patty, for 100. And? And the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas, <laughs> with 109. Oh, it's not loser, it's sixth yeah. place. Oh, no, wait, wait. <laughs> sixth place. <laughs> Hey, pack in, pack out. There's no, there's no loser in this game. And the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs> and the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs> and the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs>
shove the other in the bag with the rerun shows and the cocaine nose job. The daytime crap of the folk singer slob. He hung himself with a guitar string. A slab of turkey neck and it's hanging from a pigeon wing. But get right if you can't relate. Trade the cash for the beat, for the body, for the hate. And my time is a piece of wax falling on a termite. It's choking on the splinters. So... No, what? What's the story on the the T-shirts you made, the um, Crusaders T-shirts? It said the Crusaders killed for Christ. Yeah. And so, so where? Well, what, tell what's the? I know that, but what's the background? And how did you come up with the idea? Why did you want to do that? Well, All I'm that. just thinking about, you know, who the Crusaders were in the Middle Ages, and they said it was Europe's great failure, like they failed to conquer the Middle East, but they at least organized among themselves and had national armies. And that's how they came out of the dark ages or something. So I thought it was very inspirational. Hot, hot tea, hot lemon or something? No, thank you. Sorry. Hot, hot tea, hot lemon or something? No, thank you. Sorry. Yeah, I mean, literally right behind his house. Right next to his bedroom. Yeah. And we had this... We had this rumor that we had basically invented that he had like a 13 year old wife or something. <laughs> and, and he had a bug light, so one of those neon lights. So we would go up there in our underwear, and our underwear would turn bright white or purplish in the, in the Yeah, and it would glow. And we, it, was, uh, it was Roxanne. It was yes, Roxanne. Yeah, it was ro Dad, okay. Look at the Pentagon. <laughs> you yeah. don't have to put out the bug light. <laughs> Somebody oh, else. Oh, Who wrote this? He just missed the Who whole shit this? in the box. But did oh, you eat all of it? Oh, it's wet and it's warm and oh. <laughs> it's so wet. Gosh. This is the best present. Oh. oh uh, namaste, you guys. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Namaste. Mark, <coughs> I'll see you in Kino. Be there. Kino, I don't know what that is. I don't know. See you in Kino. <laughs> Kino. Okay, Kino I don't Bay. know where that is. So <laughs> Kino not... Bay, in oh. Mexico. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, just drive south for a while and take a right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can't miss it. <laughs> I'll find it. It was good to see you. I always find it. Uh, well, th thanks for coming all this way, Mark, to, to see us. It's good to see you again. And uh, let's, uh, let's do it again soon. That's what I would say first thing in the morning. Sean, I was against the Iraq war. And the loser <laughs> is me, Nicholas. <laughs>
Uh, yeah, so the uh, Montana trip uh, was awesome. Um, it was just what I needed. I have uh, had some bad days recently and um, hoping to put all that behind me. My uh, advice to everyone is uh, I know we, you know, spent a lot of time running around and and uh, some of us drank a little bit more than maybe we should have. Uh, so my advice is uh, take the time to sleep in when you can. Um, I know, you know, I tried to on this trip, but every time I would, Chris would come in and sit down right next to me, um, hovering over me, just staring at me, hoping I'd wake up. I even I heard him mutter to himself, Oh, I think this is going to be the time when he... Oh, no. God. So, yeah. Sleep in. That's my advice. Stuck where you are, but in your dreams you can buy expensive cars or live on Mars and have it your way. And you hate your boss at your job, but in your dreams. You can blow his head off In your dreams Show no mercy
is me, <laughs> Nicholas. <laughs>